And you know me now. When I come out that tunnel, I got a little wiggle for him. Now you got it with me? All right, let, let's see the squirrel. Just give me a little wiggle. Give me a good one. Ah, Ooh, that's, right, it, that's, that's it. That's right. it. I give you that. I give you that. <laughs> let's talk though about this defense. How yeah. much does it remind you of your championship? Yeah, it defense? does. It does because it has a leader that everybody follows. Roquan Smith has become, you know, the apparent leader that the guy that wants to be vocal, the guy that wants to make the plays, the guy that wants to keep everybody in line. And when you have a guy on defense like that that everybody rallies around, that's a special thing to have. Uh, I know a little bit about that, right? But it's special to see. And you talk about Jadavian Clowney, the way his career has just resurged to come out and play the way he's playing in this game, right? The young talent that we have in all this is Patrick Crean running around. This is a very physical and good defense. I'm excited to see it. Well, we talked about it in terms of you and being the leader of your defense. You were the guy who gave the final pregame speech. That belongs to Roquan now. But if you were in the locker room, what would you say to them before they take yeah, the th th There's nothing to say. No, Tracy, like sometimes you know, I give these speeches. But when I look at them like, bruh, you have no, there's no other option. Right? Like, not right now. I don't need nothing else. I don't need what's in your text. I don't need what's home. I need to get I need you to give me everything you got right now. That's I have those instincts. I kind of want to just go rush the passer yes. right now. But that's those things you have to do in big games like this, just like on the other side. They have to be very lane efficient to make sure they take care yep. of Lamar. On this side, if you can get somebody to get a hand on Travis Kelsey at the line of scrimmage, it helps at least disrupt the start of his I, route. I think if I were Mike McDonald, the defensive coordinator of the Ravens, I would go back to Super Bowl 55. A game that we all had here and we all saw what did we all see we all saw the Tampa Bay Buccaneers defense shut down that offense of the Kansas City Chiefs and force them to three field goals and I'll tell you what when you look at the owner Steve Bashotti hugging, uh, hugging Lamar Jackson before the game that tells you all you need to know about this organization well let me the just owner say of this football team who is as underappreciated or under I guess stated as anybody in the NFL oh no be clear he is a Appreciated. He's just one of the quietest. He doesn't seek the camera hey. or the spotlight, but he gets it and he hires the right people. Can work. And that staff has been in place for a long time, and I commend him for that. This stand, this this stadium, oh, we're just with Roquan Smith. He got this whole place jacked up. If this doesn't get you fired up, I don't know what does. I'm with you, Roquan. Come on. <laughs>